In these type of balls, it's uh, a bandolier style. Uh, when you get in, make sure the strap's nice and tight. Randy, is there any better way to get your aggression out than battling inside a giant ball? I, I haven't found one. This is the best experience. I've seen 50-year-old people have a smile like they're 8 years old again. They kind of reconnect with that inner kid. And so it's just such a fun environment to do that. It's safe. It's an airbag hitting an airbag. I don't know about reconnecting with my inner kid, but Nika Clark's out there, and so is Joe Sargis. And I've got my battle ball face on, and I'm out for blood. So let's get me in the battle ball. I'm in a bubble. I'm the new bubble boy. Uh, battle balls is a sport that started in Norway as a joke. Two guys were sitting around saying we should just put some big bubbles on ourselves and play soccer. Battle balls are played in any uh, any field. Uh, we can do it indoors. We can do it outdoors. Uh, it, it's an uh, intense and fun game. It's a chance to uh, to even the parity. You know, in soccer you have very skill levels. Uh, here you have somebody who can be smaller and not as skillful play just as well in battle balls versus soccer. Can you put my shoe back on? <laughs> yeah, just like that. Oh boy. It's been uh, bachelor parties, it's been birthday parties. It, it, it's a phenomenal team building because uh, where else can like uh, an employee knock their boss off their feet and both of them laugh about it. Yeah, kids can do it. We do have different size bubbles. So right now these are the adult bubbles. It's 1.5 meter. We have smaller ones which can fit somebody from like a 7 to 11 for birthday party and kids love it. I mean they naturally have a lot of energy and uh, this is a great outlet to get that energy out. It's really hot in there, but boy is it fun running around hitting people, playing soccer. Soccer with hitting people, it's awesome. I highly recommend it. Well, it's like really unexpected. Like you're like walking and somebody just hits you from behind. Um, it's really good to get hit by the wall because then you just bounce off the wall. But when you fall, sometimes you go 360, 720. It's like, you're like, oh my God, I don't know what to do. And it's really hard to get up sometimes, but it's fun. It's so much fun.